Hello YouTubers and welcome to another Disney Pixar Cars Diecast Review and today we're going to take a look at Jeff Gorvet, the American World Grand Prix Racer, number 24 and today is also February 4th which I would consider it Jeff Gordon Day which February is the second month of a year and the fourth is the fourth day of February so it matches Jeff Gordon's racing number 24 so before we get right into the review let me discuss something so Jeff Gorvet is was one of the contenders that attended the World Grand Prix competition around the globe and he also raced in the 24 Hours of Le Mans, and is good friends with Lewis Hamilton and, of course, Lightning McQueen. And, and, during, the, and during the race in Porto Corsa, Italy, he, during the wreckage, he, he and Lewis were able to apply the brakes just in time to avoid getting involved into the wreck. And, and was also and was also one of the playable characters in the Cars 2 video game and he along with Nigel Gearsley were did not appear in the Cars Fastest Lightning game and probably due to avoid copyright issues with the card trademarks he and he, and before 2016, he retired from racing, and he he retired from racing. So he is a Corvette. He is a Chevrolet Corvette C6R, and was voiced and inspired by the real Jeff Gordon, who previously worked on Disney's other racing films, um, Herbie Fully Loaded, along with fellow NASCAR driver. Dale Earnhardt Jr. and fellow boy and Chick Hicks's voice actor Michael Keaton, who played Ray Payton Sr. Oh, and, uh, so now, let's get right into the review. Here we've got his bright yellow paint job and his working headlights and his angry facial expression no tampos on the hood and on the left side we've got the American flag tampos and his exhaust pipe and the World Grand Prix logo World Grand Prix logo and the all in all logo and the WGP number 24 and his side view mirrors and his chrome gray rims on his black wall tires and on the and on the spoiler we've got the World Grand Prix logo and on the back we've got his exhaust pipes and the WGP number 24 and the the Corvette logo which the Corvette logo itself doesn't appear on the front and so this one is an inaccurate model and I do hope to get an accurate version of this car so anyhow, we've got the tail lights and the World Grand Prix logo and powered by all in all and the American flag. And on the left side, similar design but completely different. And that is it. So now let's compare Jeff to the other racers with the number 24. We've got the Team Vitaling Racers that share his number. Rick Yardley and Jeff Gorvet, and other Chevy vehicles such as Dale Earnhardt Jr. and oh, hold on, I forgot something. Also got May Mater, who is a Dale Earnhardt Jr., who is a 2000 Chevy Monte Carlo. Mater, who is a 1957 Chevy truck, I believe. Papo, who is a 1947 Chevrolet Coupe. 
Daryl Cartrip, who is a 1977 Chevrolet Monte Carlo. Hold on. Just a moment. Just keep on forgetting. You know, sometimes I keep on forgetting these days. Oh well. And lastly, Ramon, who is a 1959 Chevrolet Impala Lowrider Hot Rod. And now let's pull up some of the other World Grand Prix contenders. We've got his two good friends, Lightning McQueen and Lewis Hamilton, Francesco Bernoulli, Nigel Gearsley, Max Schnell, Raul Sorrell, Shu Todoroki, Carlo Veloso, and lastly, but not leastly, Miguel Camino. And that is pretty much it. So, what do you guys think? Which racer number 24 is your favorite? Which Chevy vehicle is your favorite? And which World Grand Prix contender is your favorite also? Leave your thoughts in the comments down below. And if you have enjoyed this video, make sure you thumbs up and subscribe. Also, don't forget to leave any suggestions of which car of the past from the Cars Collection video should I review next. And, and I hope to see you guys next time for another review, so please stay tuned. And I'm still hoping to get some old cars and new, new cars of the past and present and future that had been either packaged or bagged or unpackaged or unbagged. Right. So I'll probably need some help. So anyhow, goodbye now.